Hi, I'm Helen Terry and I'm here at Soma Ranch and I have the honor to be having a conversation with, I say, the one, the only, the super fantastic Miss Elaine Dunphy. <laughs> and um, I am really honored and excited that you're coming on board to be part of what we're calling our um, fabulous rock stars teachers. Yeah. So, um, so thank you for being part of the team and I just wanted to introduce you. So um who's elaine how would you describe yourself and what do you want to share with people oh my goodness okay well first of all thanks for the invite that sounded like if i ever won like a golden globe or whatever you call it that that's how i would like to be introduced that's yes okay. yeah the one the only um so i am elaine dunphy i am from paradise newfoundland canada and um let me see i did my white belt in 2016 with martha randall that was amazing and then i did my blue belt with uh britta von Toggen. um i've done my moving to heal and i am also an ageless grace um educator so i'm looking forward to bringing uh ageless grace and a bit of seated mia uh to this 30-day challenge as well when i um teach a class so yeah i'm super excited yeah, I have really loved getting to know you as a participant on the 3030 challenge. And um, that's something I love about how we're doing this is that you already know the community, you already have had a feel for the challenge. And um, so I'm, I'm curious of what you've enjoyed so far. And what are you excited about? What would you like to share about this next, I guess, you're part of the next stage of the evolution of our 3030 group. <laughs> Well, I'm pretty, pretty proud to be part of it because I, I was excited to join the 30 day challenge and then invite a few local people on board um, and thrilled to say that, you know, some of the people that have joined have gone on to do their white belt, one of them right now. So um, just happy to be able to bring people to the NIA table for me is excellent because as, as we all know, um, it, people when they love it, they love it. And I just think what you've done with this community, it's just a real feel good thing. Like if I can't do the class live, I watch the whole thing. Cause you sometimes say, you know, fast forward 10 minutes. I never fast forward. Cause like, that's where the juicy parts are. <laughs> yeah. And I really do like how we can talk before and after class. And like I said, those people that want to fast forward through it, they can. And I found recently how participants really do like getting the recording both in the speaker view where they can see me larger, but how much folks are also enjoying getting to be in the gallery view where they get to see all the other people who are there taking the class live. So yeah. I'm glad you like the conversations. Yeah. yeah. Well, um, and I love that you taught recently, you, you really helped me out when I was in a power failure and you just stepped in and um, I know your sound system wasn't that great and we promised to do over and you got to do that a couple of weeks ago. And I loved taking your class, particularly with your spaghetti working the way it's supposed to. <laughs> and, um, and I was just curious, like what your background is, is for me taking your class, I, I have this impression that you haven't really been teaching near that long. And yet, um, your musicality, like how you selected the songs, how you dance to the music, and your beautiful voice that I don't know what's going on inside your head, but the appearance is that you're just having a good time, sharing with your voice in a way that feels very um, comforting and clear. So what's your background? Have you been teaching long? and? No, well, thank you very much. That's lovely to hear. Um, uh, I, I started teaching in 2017. And then I did my ageless grace training in 2020. But my background is belly dancing. So I've been a belly dancer since 2006. So it was part of the lure of Nia for me with the shimmies and the undulations. Um, and it just really, it Nia deepened my belly dance love. So um, there's music in my bones and I, I love to move. Um, and I just love the way that Nia, like I said before, invites people to the table to try it. And 
like there's something for everyone. If I invite someone into the class and they're a little unsure, um, I can get them with dance arts, healing arts, or martial arts. Like if there's, if you can't find something in Nia that you like, you're not trying hard enough. That's my, <laughs> yeah, that's my thought. Yeah, that's beautiful. So if there is someone watching this video, um, let's say like two sides. So if there's someone brand new who's never done Nia, what would you like to share with them? And then on the flip side, if there's a Nia teacher, like you are a Nia teacher and you came into the 30 day challenge, and I think that you found some benefits for you personally and professionally. So what would you share to a newbie and what would you share to a Nia teacher that's thinking about joining us? Oh, okay, so I would say to a newbie, um, welcome to the family, because that's what you've created here. That's what it feels like. It feels like this safe place to go with no judgment. Um, and I always say in a brand new class with my students, if you have two left feet, then Nia is the perfect opportunity for you to come in because sometimes I do. And I love to say that I am perfectly imperfect and oftentimes catch myself saying, yeah, hear that? That was the first beat that we were supposed to be on and we'll catch it on the next one. Um, and what I have found is it leaves people with a comfort of, okay, she's human and and is okay with you know saying we'll catch it on the next one and then to any teachers um if you haven't taken the 30-day challenge then you need you must sign up and <laughs> i'm not someone who says should but i have learned i have learned so many you have taught me ease i think if there's anything you have taught me ease of you know if something goes wrong or just your your Friday fun day, I am, that is a bucket list item for me that I'm going to be brave enough to say, yes, throw eight songs at me and I'm just going to shuffle them and press play and go. So before I leave this world, or at least this 30 day challenge, someday I'm going to do a Friday fun day. Yeah, I actually have you scheduled in August, so we'll see if that actually happens. Oh boy, okay, I was really kidding. I just, I just got goosebumps just then. <laughs> August, okay, I think I'm going to be on vacation. Plenty of time. Yeah, I, I have this dream for each of you that I would like to actually, in advance, select a playlist which I think you would really love and also be super successful with. But music that you don't know, but that I'll have done the background that I'll create a playlist and it'll be trust me I think this is going to be good for you and it will either be inviting you to improv or it might be um, knowing a routine that you know well and I'll select other songs and say play with the cat as you know from this routine with this new music something like that so that's oh what sure like. something like that yeah my heart rate is is escalated right now <laughs> You got plenty of plenty of months to play with it. Yeah, I, I love how go. You I have to study. Yeah, I have to study now. <laughs> but see, this is what I love about your your humor and lightness, and how you stay relaxed, even though you might have a little bit of raised heart rate and anxiety. Um, something I think I, I really appreciate about you and everybody on our fabulous team is. Um, there's a great book called um, Good to Great. And in the book, it talks about um, level five leadership. Have you heard about this? No, no. And so, so level five leadership is people that, ex that exude um, personal humility coupled with professional drive. And I see you as definitely a fifth level leader who um, has her heart in the right place. You seem to love still being the student and learning and sharing and your humanness is um, infectious. So thank you so much. Well, um, I'm glad you're on board. Anything else you wanna share with everyone before we click off? No, I'm just super excited. So I guess um, this coming Tuesday is uh, dipping my toe in the water again, and then I'll be um, in in the mix <laughs> for January. So yeah, let's make sure we have the date in case people are watching and they don't know what day of the week it is now. So next Tuesday, what's the date? Do you have December that? 13th. 
December the 13th. And then we have you again in January. Do you have that date? Let me see. Oh, goodness. Tenth. Tuesday, the 10th of January. Yeah. yeah. And we're going to be posting the schedule so everyone will know that. So um, thank you so much. Welcome aboard. I'm really glad you're with us. And um, I'm loving how this is coming together. So. Me too. I'm looking forward to to working with everyone on this on this team. And thanks for the invite. And I look forward to working with all the people in I call it the Partridge family. So looking forward <laughs> to that. Very much so. Well, thank you.